What is up guys, my name is Muzelk, and today we're going to be doing something very, very special. We're going to be bringing back one of the oldest series on this channel, and when I say old, I really, really do mean old. Because this thing, I don't think I've done one of them in about, I don't know, six or eight months now, maybe even a year? Uh, and that is going to be the worst loadout in TF2 series. And once again, I say series, that is also a lie, because I only ever did one of them. I always intended it to become a series, uh, but it never really turned out that way. And uh, for those of you wondering, you know, what the hell is this crazy thing you're talking about? Music, what, what, you, what you talking about? Uh, what this series is, is effectively the opposite to the Is It OP series, uh, where instead of going for the strongest weapons in TF2, we try and think of the worst possible loadout you could have for a class. And if you guys can think of one that beats what I choose, then you should be sure to put that in the comment section so I can try it out another time. But uh, if I can just survive here, as you can probably see today, we're going to be using the Degreaser, the, the knockbacker one, the Scotch Shot. And we got a kill with the third weapon, which is going to be the Neon Annihilator. What is this spy doing? I don't even know anymore. Uh, but yeah, now, a lot of the people, you know, they'll look at this and they'll be like, Well, look, you got the Degreaser. I mean, that's like one of the strongest weapons. Right? I see every pyro using that. But the Degreaser by itself is actually a pretty weak weapon. Oh, get crit. Get crit. Oh, God. Okay, I suck. I suck. I suck. I shouldn't try and... Ready? Watch this. Watch this, it's going to be some next level stuff, if we can dodge the mini sentry. Uh, but yeah, so the Degreaser is actually a terrible weapon when used by itself, because it fully relies on being able to combo well with other weapons that you have. As we just going to WM1 this guy down, just kill the medic, please die. Thank god, he's dead. Yeah, so, you know, the Degreaser is often used with stuff like the Flare Gun, so you can quickly set someone on fire, switch to your Flare Gun, crit them, then change over to your critty axe weapon thing, and then just beat them down with that until they're dead. Became a li little uh, less powerful after the most recent update, but by itself, it's actually not that good because it deals less damage. Uh, so it's, it's not as strong as a normal flamethrower. It's only better in the fact that it'll let you change weapons quickly. Which, as I said, with the right with the right weapons, is amazingly powerful. But uh, with stuff like the Scorch Shot and the Neon Annihilator, a lot less so. Uh, and that's what we're going to be using it with today. We're also using the Neon Annihilator on a map that has absolutely no water on it anywhere, as far as I can think of. Actually, no, there is, there is some at the start of the second point. So maybe we'll get a chance to use that, and uh, maybe we'll get a chance to knock someone off this cliff or something. I don't really know. It's, it's a weird map. But um, yeah, we're going to see how it goes. Probably poorly is how it's going to go, as we're just going to come in here and WM1 down, and there's going to be a spy. No, there isn't. I thought he was there. I was tricked. There is. Is that Fathead? Is that Fathead? I know a Fathead when I see one. Fathead is a, uh, a heavy player that I know who is actually quite annoying to kill. Um, so yeah, we're just going to do a full gameplay with it. We'll see how it goes, uh, and hopefully it'll go, you know... Not as expected, because it would suck if we got no kills this entire gameplay. But I, I honestly, I have no idea how I'm going to be getting kills. I don't know where the damage is going to be coming from. Because if you look at this, this weapon, Scorch Shot, good for knocking people around. But it basically sets them on fire and does pretty much nothing else. I think that right there reflects. That's how we're going to have to get most of our kills. Because this thing here, it does a lot less damage than a normal, uh, a normal flamethrower. Just, no, I need that health, bro. I need that health. You better be leaving me alone now. There we go. This does a lot less weapon, uh, a lot less weapon, a lot less damage than the normal flamethrower. And the Neon Annihilator, while it's really good against wet enemies, uh, by by itself, it's 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 not not that strong at all. Although it can take off sappers in two hits, so I thought that was a pretty interesting thing to note. Uh, so we're gonna see if we can get another reflect kill. Oh god, this guy's got the beggar's bazooka. There we go, reflect kill. That's what you want. After a while. Once you've just played the game for a little bit, you kind of realize the reload animations, and people, when they're against a pyro, will often panic and just try and quickly uh, shoot as soon as their stuff is off reload, and then you can basically figure out how to reflect without even having to re react to them firing it, even though that's something I, I still suck so much at. So we're going to try and avoid getting headshot here. Uh, we got body shot, though. It's fine. It's fine. Just back up. I need that health, man. Should we... Don't WM1 that guy. See, his weapon does a lot more damage than ours, so that's not a fight we want to be taking. We're just going to come here, and we are going to heal up. Now, if we win this round really quickly, which it looks like might happen... Oh my 
stars. It is Fathead. I knew it. I knew it. <laughs> I guess he didn't realize there was a sentry in here. Uh, if we do end up winning this round, uh, like it looks like we're about to really, really quickly as we dodge all the pipes. Matrix man right here. Uh, we'll probably end up doing another little bit of an attack round or something like that. I don't know. Whoa, random crits, please. Should we go for a bit of a... Just keep trying to knock people off the card here, because this is like a little thing. <laughs> They're literally... Oh, <laughs> we're missing everything. This is why I'm a terrible... Look, not one of these is hit. Oh, God, this is in... <laughs> that went so... I don't think that could have gone any worse than what just happened there. And it looks like they're going to cap, so we might have a game on our hands here, ladies and gentlemen. Okay. We're going to have to pull out our finger here and get to the defense, although I have no idea how we're going to be defending anything. Although, I wonder, can you do kind of like jump? You can do, I think, little uh, jumps with this. Kind of like the, the detonator, although I don't think the jumps are quite as large as detonator jumps, so we'll test it here. Yeah, so you can. You can do small jumps. Although they're not nearly as big. Uh, so we might be able to find our way into some cool little flank routes. And, oi, oh, mate, I'm warning you. Hey, we set a guy on fire. Back out. I gotta reflect, mum. No! You probably got a sandwich anyway. Oh, God, that new, that new shield is so unbelievably strong. I'm gonna need to grab that. Leave me alone. Oh, we got him. We set him on fire again. We keep setting him on fire. We're going to lose this fight. But I don't even care. We set that guy on fire so many times right there. Oh god, we're dead. We're dead. Oh god, no, we got a Neon Annihilator kill. Wait, no, he, he burnt out. Okay, well, it doesn't matter. We hit him. That's all that matters. We're going to try and find the health. There it is. Okay. I kind of think this is a pretty good place for us to play because it's kind of close range. We can WM1 people down if we need to. And I think we're just going to have to get good at reflecting, which I'm... Hey, we got a kill! I'm, I'm, I'm learning, guys. This is the power of learning. Okay, should we try and go for a flank? I am so... Oh. Oh, God, that's Fathead. That's Fathead right there. Should we go for this? Show you guys what we're going to do here. Oh, yeah, I got it. I got it. Now we run. Now we run. <laughs> Please leave me alone. Please leave me alone. I didn't do anything to her. Oh god, they're gonna cap. This is my problem. I get so distracted just doing my own thing. I completely forget about the fact that there's an actual object. Oh god, now we're, now we're dead. <laughs> well, I gotta say, this is kind of going as expected, but uh, I might quickly skip forward here until the start of the next round so we don't have to go through all this boring ass shut up time. We're here today observing the endangered pyro shark. One of the last of its kind in the DF2 universe, as he sits in the water, waiting for his prey to arrive. That is what we're going to be doing here, guys. The Pyro Shark with the Neon Annihilator, and we're hopefully just going to sit in this ditch, waiting for someone to swim by. Although, i got a bad feeling this is going to go completely not according to plan, and we are going to end up dying. So for now, we're just going to quickly come out here. Jesus, everyone's going flying everywhere. Hopefully we can stop this scout from running everywhere that he wants to go. Oh, I almost reflected that. I was so close. You guys saw it. I've got video proof. I wonder if when people are jumping by here, we can kind of go like... No, okay. We're not going to be able to do that. We're going to have to try and bait someone into the water. Okay, that's what we're going to do. If we can get one pyro shark kill, I will be... I will die a happy pyro shark. Oh, God. Oh, God. <laughs> got the random spy. That's... Oh, God. The beggar's bazooka random crits. What can you do? Hopefully we can respawn quickly and get back into our little pyro shark hovel. Hey, we killed the guy. Don't you hate that though when you're a spy and you're all you're all excited and invisible, ready to go out and, and backstab some people and work your French ass off, but then, you know, there's just that random pyro who's just random like blah, 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 like that and accidentally sets you on fire and then you cry because it wasn't your fault. Hopefully this guy will totally forget that I existed. I'm not even here. Yes, 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 yes. Got him! Oh my god, look at him get obliterated! And you too! No! <laughs> oh my god, that kill animation is amazing. How did I stuff that up? How did I not get the pyro? Oh my god, this is this is what happens. As soon as we pull out a worse loadout thing, I just start I just start playing worse as well. Like I, I just don't have any confidence in what I'm doing. But hopefully we'll be able to get back quickly and uh, get a couple of kills. 
before the point ends. No, they got the teleport. Okay, don't worry, don't worry. We're fine. We're going to sneak behind them all. Sneaky, sneaky like. Get some kills. Quick medic, I want to save you and harvest points off your flaming corpse. Okay, what should we do? I feel like, yeah, no, we're not going there anymore. That is a little bit too suicidal now. Yeah, we got a medic. Yeah, medic. No, oh god, he left me. <laughs> he left me just like all my friends and everyone that ever loved me. Just kidding. No one ever loved me. Oh, reflect. See, that's the thing. Like, you kind of know when they're going to shoot. I don't have any reaction times at all. You just got to kind of guess and predict. And sometimes you get it right, sometimes you don't. I wonder how long people stay wet for once they hop out of the water. We're going to go for these people here. I think I think we can get them. I think we can get this guy here. This guy here. He's AFK. There we go. No! No! <laughs> that's like all we're doing. Just running up to people and trying to crit them. I just love, I just love that it like evaporates them and the sound it makes, like all electric, all electric like, it's just, it's just, it's just a, such a satisfying way to kill someone. Although not very good as far as us actually doing well goes. We're 11 for 6, we could be worse, I guess, although this video feels a lot more like me just staying, al staying alive than actually uh, killing people. There we go. God, don't you just love that? Just the flaming person getting... Obliterate, evapor, evapobliterated. That's what I'm gonna call it. Is there a spy in here? No, you're just. How did you even get up there? Oh boy, that really hurt. Yeah, I'm sorry. I just need to go this way right now. Get this health. Thank you very much. You can just leave me alone. I would really appreciate that. No offense, pirate, but I'm kind of busy here, I'm trying to do my own thing, and you're just kind of cramping my style. I hope, oh, damn, I was hoping you wouldn't see me. <laughs> I'm just going to run back here and get this. Hey, look, you're a spy. Isn't that interesting? No, okay, he's going to run. Like the little baby he is. And that's where he's going to run to. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, direct hit. See, if I can't reflect normal rockets, I'm no way I'm going to be able to reflect a direct hit. Although, you know, that's my dream one day, to get a reflect direct hit midi. One day it'll come true. Okay. What's the plan here, Stan? Where does this go? Okay, then. That is a very questionable sentry spot for that exact reason. The fact that they're just going to spam down from up there. And they're eventually going to kill it, I can almost guarantee you. This scout is also very scary. Well, it looks like someone got him. As we're kind of trapped in here, and we can't really go anywhere. Unless this medic could heal me. I, I want to extinguish that guy, but I am not walking there. Okay, this medic. Yep, Uber, don't, don't fail me now. Yes, thank God. Don't you hate it when a medic's like, yeah, I'm totally going to uber you and he's healing you as you're walking forward and then we're just going to W on one here because, you know, who cares about actually doing something skillful? I would just take effort. No, I wanted to get you with my Neon Annihilator. <laughs> is he going to burn to death? I think he is. Let's watch the kill feed, guys. No, there's, a bo there's water right there. I forgot. He's just going to jump in the water. He'll extinguish himself. It's not going to be a kill. Oh my God, look at that cart. Do you reckon we're going to be able to defend that for two minutes or a minute and 55? I don't know. Look, this pyro is going to cap it right now. Yep, there you go. <laughs> Team just lets him walk on. Actually, I don't want to take that. I want to try something a bit different here. So, instead of taking that teleport, I know that you can do these little kind of mini scorch jump jumps. They're not like full detonator jumps, but they're kind of like mini jumps. So, we'll, we'll see if we can do that if it's enough to get us over here. Yeah, there you go. So, it can actually open up a couple of cool little avenues Oh my god, there we go. Run away. Run the hell away from that guy. Give me the health, please. And for anyone who watched the map tips and tricks video, another cool way to get up there is uh, off this sink. Oh god. Look, look at me fail. Look at me fail. Oh god, look at me fail again. I'm gonna do this. Like that. There you go. Beautiful. Okay. It's a soldier. There's a soldier around these parts. I, I want to, like, knock someone off a cliff. I should have done upward or something so I could kind of knock people off with the scorch shot, but I guess that would kind of defeat the purpose if I was doing easy maps with a worse loadout in TF2 video. I wonder... Oh, God. Here we go. Here we go. You little... He's going to get a random crit. No, he's not. Thank God. What are you doing here? Get down. Sneak little devil. I wonder. This won't work. Oh, man, if we had the detonator, we could do that. But no, they had to give us the scorch shot. Who even likes the scorch shot, anyway? Oh, God, that's a spy. I was like, you 
or an awfully handsome man dressing like me. You're a bit too handsome, though. Suspiciously handsome, even. There we go. Got the nomination. I need ammo. Where's the ammo? I need ammunition. There we go. Oh, boy. Hey, man, you guys all know the phlogistonator is OP. Because we did that in Is It OP episode. Oh, God, no. Look at that. He's like, he's like, ah, oh, you want the health back? Nah, sorry, my health back. There you go. Oh, God. I'm not interested in fighting you, sorry. I'm going up here. I'm going to my health pack station. And see, a lot of people, they'll come around this corner. They won't even consider the fact that I could be here. They're probably going to turn around and kill me right now, but most people wouldn't. Okay. Let's just hide up here. Let's just hide. Never find us. Oh, there he is. There he is. No! No! I will save you, engineer! I will save you! Yes, we got him. Look at that. Three health survival. Anytime, friend. Anytime or day of the week, I'll be there for you. There's a demo here, isn't there? You just dropped down here, didn't you? Did you? Where'd he go? Whoa! What? He was here. Where did he go? What? What? Oh, there he is. Come back here, you little... Get back. There we go. Dead. Why didn't you pick up that health pack? He was really hurt. Some people, they just don't make any sense. Oh, God, that really hurt. He's going to burn out. Yes, we got him. We got him. This web sucks. Killed cow. Beautiful. Okay, what's our next plan? I'm just liking staying around that top area, actually. Just surprising people, jumping around, hitting them with a neon annihilator, evaporating their bodies into the realm of nothingness. It's 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 pretty satisfying, I'm not going to lie. I, I really do enjoy burning people and evaporating people and just generally being... Oh, that's a heavy... That's not what you want to fight. There we go. Reflect that and just keep running. Okay, what should we... Don't be... You're legit. Oh, I'm going to regret this. Why did I do that? Why did I think that was going to be a good idea? What are the stats on the Neon Annihilator? I honestly don't remember. No random critical hits and negative 20% damage, right? I actually think, compared to the default Fire Axe, it can be a really, really good weapon on, on maps that have lots of water. Like, I think I think that's when... Should we just keep... Right. Oh, no. Sorry. Not interested. Get back. Leave him alone. There we go. He died. I really want to try and do one of the one of the rocket jumps, the reflect rocket jumps that I see all the pro pyros do. Ready? We're gonna do one. We're gonna do one. No, nope, not there. Come on, shoot at my feet. No, ow! <laughs> that really hurt. Come on. Ready? Oh, look at that! I did one! Mom, get the camera! Holy crap, they're about to win! Should we just sit up here? Oh boy, did he see me? Oh, there we go. No, go for it! Oh, it really hurts. I want to win. I really want to win. No, not the Phlogistonator Pyro. He's been the biggest dick this entire... Oh, look at that. No. Oh, what clutch. What an ending. What a game. Oh, that was amazing. That was that was just that was just an all-round incredible finish. Oh, that, that jump. I've never, ever done a Pyro Reflect Rocket Jump thing before. But you guys were here. We witnessed history together as I became a slightly less terrible pyro than I normally am. So, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I would love to know if you guys think there is a uh, worse loadout for the pyro class that I could try out. Or if you've got another terrible loadout for another class, I'd definitely be interested in trying that one out as well. So put those down in the comments below. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I will see you in the next one.